out of your money how much more it costs to feed your family. In December, we showed you that a cart of groceries cost $22 more than it did a year ago. So what about now? What's happened since then in just six months? 12 on your side's Marilyn Moritz with another foodflation price check. Checking out is adding up. Aisle after aisle, food prices are climbing. Everything from the vegetables to the bread, to the cereal, the milk, the eggs. Oh my goodness, the eggs, it's ridiculous. Denise Salinas just spent 300 bucks. I didn't buy no meat. <laughs> and I was like, just how fast are prices rising? To find out, we shopped the same items we priced last winter for curbside pickup at the same store. And here's what we found. The same groceries that cost $224 just six months ago now cost $15 more. Inflation has a seat at the kitchen table. Check it out. The price of our milk soared 42%. And breakfast? Eggs are up 16%. Bacon up 10%. Coffee perked up another 9% and get this, oatmeal cost a whopping 58% more. Making a sandwich for lunch, this bread is up 23%, the sliced turkey up 16%, and this mayo, it's up 29%. You just try and do the best that you can with what's out there, you know. A lot of chicken and a lot of hamburger meat. But that meat and potato supper is also costing more, chicken thighs up 3%. Ground sirloin rising nearly 6%, and those potatoes, 30% more. But when it comes to prime ribeye, it's actually cheaper, down 18%, a rare thing. It's not getting any better. And it won't anytime soon, economists say, not as long as supply chain, gasoline, and Ukraine issues remain. And here's one more cold hard fact, our ice cream is up 14%. Not exactly the scoop you were hoping for. Marilyn Moritz, KSAT 12 News.